Welcome to the irreverent world of Married. With Children, a groundbreaking TV series that premiered in 1987 and redefined the sitcom landscape. Set in a blue-collar suburban environment, the show challenged conventional family portrayals with its raw humor and unconventional characters. It dared to explore the dysfunctional dynamics of the Bundy family, spearheaded by Al Bundy, a disillusioned shoe salesman, his wisecracking wife Peg, their two obnoxious children, and the nosy neighbors. Known for its unapologetic satire, and boundary-pushing comedy, Married. With children courted controversy and captivated audiences with its unfiltered take on the American family, the series consistently pushed the boundaries of what was considered acceptable on television, making a lasting impact on the industry and paving the way for future unconventional sitcoms. Can you share a personal story of how this TV series has inspired or impacted your life? Or what enduring qualities do you think make this series an everlasting symbol of the industry? We would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Did you know that the show's initial reception was mixed, but it later garnered a dedicated fanbase and ran for 11 seasons, becoming a cult classic? Tune in for a glimpse into the peculiar, yet relatable world of the Bundys, where dysfunction meets humor in an unparalleled way. Share your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this TV series, and we would love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Get ready to reminisce and share the laughter that married. With children brought into your life, let the anecdotes flow. During the 1987 TV series Married, with children, Christina Applegate, who portrayed Kelly Bundy, differed notably from her character. Her co-stars described her as intelligent and talented, unlike the role she played. Ed O'Neill, who praised Applegate's performance, noted that only an actress of her caliber could convincingly portray the dumb blonde persona, often nailing her performance in just one or two takes. O'Neill's admiration highlighted the skill required to play such a character, emphasizing Applegate's talent and versatility in her acting role on the show. Amanda Bears, who played Marcy Rhodes, DRC in the 1987 TV series Married with children, also took on the role of director for several episodes. Her involvement expanded beyond acting, showcasing her talent behind the camera. This multifaceted contribution added depth to the show, allowing Bears to leave her mark not just as a character, but as a creative force behind the scenes, showcasing her versatility in the entertainment industry. This unique dual role she undertook highlights her capabilities both in front of and behind the camera, making her a notable figure in the production of the series. Throughout the show's run, the stars of Married, with children often brought their own families into the limelight. Ed O'Neill's wife, Catherine Rusoff, made two appearances on the show, while David Faustino's brother, Michael Faustino, also had a couple of roles. Christina Applegate's mother, Nancy Pretty, made an appearance, and Katie Sagal's brother, Joey Sagal, was also featured. The interconnectedness extended further as Elaine Hendricks and Juliet Tablack were, at one point, romantically linked to David Faustino. This integration of the actors' families added a personal touch to the series, creating a familial atmosphere both on and off-screen. The fountain shown at the beginning of the credits in the 1987 TV series Married, with children is the Buckingham Fountain in downtown Chicago. This iconic fountain served as the backdrop for the opening credits, setting the stage for the Bundy family's adventures in the bustling urban setting. The choice of this location added an authentic touch to the show's introduction, symbolizing the cityscape where the Bundys navigated their daily lives. Its prominent display in the opening credits helped establish the series' setting and provided a recognizable visual for viewers. The use of the Buckingham Fountain in the credits became a familiar and integral part of the show, representing the urban landscape where the Bundy family's quirky and comical story unfolded. Al falling off the roof in season 4, episode 13, Hall Stop the Rain, was voted one of Married with Children's Funniest Moments. In this classic episode, Al Bundy, the head of the Bundy family, faces a comedic mishap as he tumbles off the roof. This unforgettable moment became a standout highlight of the show, capturing the essence of the sitcom's humor and Al's perpetual misfortunes. The incident showcased the series' ability to blend physical comedy with the quirky, satirical nature that defined Married with Children. 
Katie Sagal, known for her role as Peggy Bundy in the 1987 TV series Married with children had a unique inspiration for her character's appearance. She suggested Peggy dress in 1960s style clothing, intending to parody the stereotypical image of a 1960s housewife. During her audition, Sagal even arrived wearing a distinctive red bouffant wig. This choice resonated with the show's producers, and Peggy's look became an integral part of the character throughout the series, contributing to the satirical essence of the show. This creative decision by Sagal played a significant role in shaping the iconic portrayal of Peggy Bundy, adding a layer of humor and satire to the character's representation in the sitcom. The name Marcy D. Arcy in the show Married with Children is actually a nod to the executive producer of The Cosby Show, Marcy Carcy. Interestingly, the working title for the series was not The Cosby's. This clever wordplay is a testament to the show's satirical and unconventional nature. It aimed to establish its unique identity apart from the more traditional family sitcoms of its time, challenging norms with its distinct brand of humor and storytelling. The use of a title referencing a well-known and respected show of the era, while starkly deviating in content and style, underscores the deliberate subversion and irreverence that became hallmarks of married with children. 3. Christina Applegate wore a long blonde wig for most of the 10th season because she dyed her hair red for a role in Nowhere which was shot during summer 1995, between the 9th and 10th seasons. Christina Applegate, known for her portrayal of Kelly Bundy in Married with Children, sported a long blonde wig throughout most of the show's 10th season. This change in appearance wasn't just a style choice, it was necessitated by her decision to dye her hair red for a role in the film Nowhere, which was filmed during the summer of 1995, occurring between the show's ninth and tenth seasons. This alteration in her appearance highlights the dedication and adaptability of actors, as they often navigate multiple roles and commitments in the entertainment industry. Al's friend, Bob Rooney, in the 1987 TV series Married, with children is consistently referred to by both his first and last name. This peculiar naming tradition becomes a recurring joke throughout the show. Even his own wife addresses him as such, showcasing a distinctive and comedic quirk. The series, known for its satirical and unconventional humor, often leverages this naming oddity for comedic effect, highlighting the quirky dynamics among the characters. This particular aspect adds a distinctive and memorable element to the show, exemplifying the unique and comedic character relationships present in Married with Children. As we conclude this retrospective journey, let's pause to appreciate the timeless allure of the 1987 TV series, Married with Children. This iconic show etched itself into the annals of television history by offering a hilarious yet unapologetically authentic portrayal of the Bundy family. As you reflect on its memorable characters, outrageous humor, and audacious storylines, perhaps you'll find echoes of your own experiences or observations about familial dynamics. Married with children wasn't just a show, it was a cultural phenomenon, challenging norms, and serving as a satirical mirror to societal conventions. Whether it was Al's constant pursuit of elusive contentment, Peg's unapologetic charisma, Bud's perpetual quest for affection, or Kelly's delightful innocence, these characters resonated with audiences in profound ways. Your connection with the series might evoke a myriad of emotions, from laughter to nostalgia, or perhaps a contemplative appreciation of its impact on the television landscape. Share your cherished memories, your favorite moments, or the aspects that made this show a timeless classic for you. By exchanging thoughts and anecdotes, we celebrate the enduring legacy of Married, with children that continues to captivate new audiences. Thank you for taking this moment to journey down memory lane and reflect on the iconic charm of the Bundy family. Your thoughts and experiences enrich the collective tapestry of this beloved series. Keep those memories alive and let the laughter linger. Until next time, thank you for your time and engagement.